Hi students, it's Mrs. Newman. If you've been um, following along, we've been doing quite a bit in our phonics and I'm really proud of you. Keep trying to do the sounds out loud. If you ever need to go back and redo a section, you know, just pause and rewind the video, right? And go back a little more. All right, let's review some of the same letters we've been working on this week. Letter is, sounds like, ah. Letter is, S, sounds like, like a spoon that even have images to help us. Letter is P sounds like P. 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 Letter is M sounds like mmm. When you think about that pizza, you go mmm. <laughs> Letter is T sounds like T, T, T. Really isolate those sounds and make them really well for me, okay? Oh, we've been really focusing on this letter this week. What is this letter? I, it's a little I. All of these letters are our small letters. And how does an I um, sound? There's a couple sounds it can make. I, I, like an igloo, or I, right? Sometimes it comes up as an E sound. But I, I is what we're gonna use a lot this week. Letter is C. The sound is K, K, K. All right, couple more. Letter is G, and it sounds like G, G. Remember yesterday we went back and forth between k, k, g, g, right? Let's, let's add a new one here. Letter is N, and it sounds like mm, mm. It's kind of even in the letter N, right? And it's like a necklace, right? Let's see what they want today. Oh, we're gonna repeat the two words that rhyme. This one's fun, let's mix it up. I'm gonna say three words. You just repeat aloud the two words that rhyme. For instance, if I said, get fat rat, you would say fat rat, okay? Roll, sell, well. Sell and well. Log, big, wig big and wig okay let's do some more bad rod pod rod pod right the two words that rhyme cab rub tub rub tub okay gum ham lamb <laughs> ham and lamb pan men pen men and pen Fuss, kiss, miss, kiss and miss, and then pup, mop, top, mop, top. And then last one, ham, gum, hum, gum, hum. Very good. Let's isolate the first sound. Cat, kitten, cat, kitten, kick, right? Repeat the two words and isolate the first sound. Same thing we do. Dive, dine, dive, Dine, d. Fog, face, fog, face. F -f -f -f. You can do the hand gestures too if it helps you. Give, goes, give, goes, g, g. Her, him, her, him. <sighs> the H there. Cap, cut, cap, cut, k, k. Jar, Jug, jar, jug, j, j, first sound. Quit, queen, quit, queen, qu, qu. Man, more, man, more, mmm. And then last one here, name, new, name, new, mmm. Okay, I'm gonna say the syllables. Remember, I'm gonna break down a word with syllables. You repeat the two syllables, then blend them together, and then tell me how many syllables there are. If I say art, ist, you say art, ist, artist. Two, we can demonstrate that right now. They're all gonna be two for a little bit, okay? But I want you to pinpoint lawyer, 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 two, spoke, Ken, spoken, spoken to explode, explode, explode to relax, 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 pretend, pretend.
10, pretend, two, right? Explain, explain, explain to cradle, 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 two, scramble, 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 two, and then final one, lotion, 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 two. Very good, students. This one's harder. You're going to identify the final sound. So we did the first sound. Now we're going to do the last sound. For example, if I said uh, milk and mic, you would repeat milk, mic. And what sound is the last sound in both words? If it was the earlier example, we would have been doing the first sound, which in Mike and milk is mmm, but this time it's going to be the last sound. So Mike, milk, those are k, k, k. It ends with k. So let's do it. Call bell. Call bell. Oh. Boat feet. Boat feet. T -t -t. Make that last sound. Ten fin. Ten, fin. Mm, did you get it? The end sound, right? Jump, tap. Jump, tap. P -p -p -p. So say the words out loud to make sure you can find those last sounds. Dress plus. Dress plus. S Some, Tom. Some, Tom. Mmm. Love cave, love cave. Mm, the V sound. Mix fox, mix fox. K -k -k -k. Has buzz, has buzz. Z Very good. Let's do our next section. Okay, so earlier we blended two syllables, two sounds of a word. Now we're going to take them apart. I'll give you a word, artist. You repeat artist and try to break it up into the sounds. Artist. And then tell me again how many sounds are in it. Two, right? How about lawyer? Lawyer. Lawyer. Two. How about spoken? Spoken. Spoken. Two. Explode. 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 Two different sounds that go together, right? Okay, how about relax? Relax. Relax. Or you could say relax. Either way. Pretend. 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 Two. Explain. 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 I want you to break it apart into the different syllables. Two sounds there. Cradle, cradle, cradle. Scramble, scramble, scramble. And then lotion, lotion, lotion. What did you recognize about those words? The ones we broke apart. Did you recognize that they were the same ones as the ones we put together? It's pretty cool. All right, we're on our last page. Okay, the word is dirty. Change dirt to spook. Spooky. The word is spooky. Change spook to cloud. Cloudy. The word is cloudy. Change it to snow. Snowy. The word is snowy. Change it to rain. Rainy. And the word is rainy. Change it to dirt. Dirty, very good. And we're gonna add to the end of a word. So I'll say, let's say park. We're gonna add ing to each of the words. So if I said park, add ing, you say parking. I'll say play, add ing, playing. <laughs> Read, add ing. And how about count, add ing. And see, add ing. Seeing. Yes, students. Now we're going to take out the last part. So if I said chunky and take out the sound E, chunk, like a chunk of something. Okay, how about speedy? Take out E, speed. How about muddy? Take out E, 
Mud, yes. How about funny? Take out E. Fun. And how about crabby? Take out E. A crab. Crabs like walk to the side, clip, clip, clip. Oh, it's our last section. It's a super fun one. I love it. I say the sentence, you repeat the sentence out loud. Then we're going to clap to figure out how many words, not syllables. Some syllables or um, words have many syllables, right? But we'll clap out how many words are in the sentence. And then we'll decide how many that is. Here's the first sentence Is it your birthday? Is it your birthday? You repeat it and then, is it your birthday? How many words? If you got four, you're correct. The puppy licked my hand. The puppy licked my hand. Together, clap it out. The puppy licked my hand. How many was that? The puppy licked my hand. Five, if you got five, you're correct. <gasps> I like to sleep in my own bed. Repeat it. I like to sleep in my own bed. I like to sleep in my own bed. Count it out, take a minute. Tell me how many words are in that sentence. There's so many. I like to sleep in my own bed. <laughs> Did you get eight? If you got eight, terrific. That's our longest one yet. How about this one? Did you ask your parents? Did you ask your parents? Clap it out. Did you ask your parents? How many? How many words? Five is correct. The teacher told us what to do. Say it. The teacher told us what to do. The teacher told us what to do. Count out how many words we just clapped. How many claps did we make? The teacher told us what to do. Two, seven. We got some bigger sentences now, huh? I listened to my teacher. Repeat it. I listened to my teacher. I listened to my teacher. I listened to my teacher. If you got five, you're on it. And last one, I like to get exercise. I like to get exercise. I like to get exercise. Count it out. How many words are in that sentence? If you got five, terrific job. Great job on your phonics today. Give yourselves a round of applause. See you soon. <laughs>